I know you're gonna dig this. I don't understand what's going on. Hey guys, this is what happened, but you weren't here, so you missed it. Got a little bit of a late start today. It's like two o'clock. <sighs> but it sure is a nice day, isn't it? <laughs> it's so warm out today. I don't have my coat on. I just have a nice light jacket on. I'm going to be picking up Sean soon. I hope he had a good day today. I didn't get any phone call from his program, so hopefully um, it was good. And uh, things are falling into place. Hopefully tomorrow... Uh, I don't know if I told you this or not, but I ordered um, the attachment for my um, KitchenAid to make pasta or to roll pasta. Thank you, Sumner, for suggesting it at the live show. I was um, thinking about it before, but then you had mentioned it again, and I was like, you know what? I'm going to go back and take a look and see. Um, you know, investigated a little bit further, and I actually ended up um, saying, yes, that's the one I want. You're the one that I want. <laughs> so that's coming tomorrow. And uh, I got, I showed you guys the other day, I got a um, pierogi, I call it a die, because it's, um, it's like a plate with the cutouts on it, so you put the layer of rolled out pasta dough down, you put your filling in, you put the other layer on top, you go over it with a rolling pin, and it cuts like six pierogies at a time. So that's pretty awesome. So I could start making them, hopefully, Friday. Do more cooking on Saturday, whatever I need to do Sunday morning. I'm uh, gonna be all set. I'm gonna be sitting pretty. I'm not gonna be like at the last minute hopefully on Sunday because that really sucks. The thing that I hate about cooking for the holidays is cooking last minute. So if I do the pierogies starting before the weekend starts, I could just pop them in the freezer. Granted that I have room in the freezer. My freezer is pretty tight right now. But when I'm ready to cook them, I just pop them out of the freezer into the boiling water, mix them with what they need to, you know, whatever sauce, and I'm good to go. It's stressless. So I'd rather, like, have something go wrong a few days before Easter, and then I know, hey, I need to make an adjustment. Nothing sucks as much as last-minute cooking and something goes wrong. Because then you're like, oh, what's plan B? <laughs> and if you don't have a plan B, you're screwed. So, I got it all under control this year, I hope. All right, it's time. You knew it was coming. Rick, not Rick. Ugh, Nick, Randy, and Pearl said, do you have a death wish? I do for that coffee. So I've got my French press, which makes it delicious, by the way. Um, French press always makes it more rich because you're pouring the boiling, you're letting the uh, grain sit in the boiling water, the grounds. So as dark and lovely as this is, it's going to be even darker and lovelier because it's in the French press. Oh yeah, baby. <laughs> oh yeah. So I need a little pick-me-up. It's like 4.30 and tonight is Survivor amongst other videos. <laughs> I really, Mark told me he wanted mashed potatoes for dinner, but I don't know exactly what I'm gonna be building around that. <sighs> I don't know. But anyway, um, I know what I'm having right now. I'm going to put the cover on this and let it sit for like five minutes and then press it out and here we go. Yeah, press it out, press it out. Wow, that's like black gold on the bottom. Beautiful, 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 beautiful Deathwish coffee. <laughs> oh, tastes even better in a Catherine B in a Catherine B mug here. Oh yeah, baby. Do I have this the right direction? No, of course not. 
There we go. Oh yeah. So guys, I usually take um, milk, non-dairy of course, in my coffee. But the other day when I went over to my friend's house, her husband made the most amazing cup of coffee. And I drank it black. And I have to say, it was pretty damn decadent. I'm, I'm not a big fan of drinking black coffee. I should have asked her what kind of coffee that was because I was just like, oh yes, thank you very much. I don't need anything else. I felt so European. What's wrong, little child? <laughs> we'll never have unicorn kisses. Guys, if you've been watching for a while or even like five minutes, you know that this family is obsessed with, pol with seltzer water. Not just any <laughs> seltzer water. Polar seltzer. Well, we drink a lot of Polar, but we drink a lot of different brands. Like right here, I got some freaking vintage. vintage. What's up? But we drink a lot of Polar, and we really appreciate the different flavors they have out there. <laughs> they're unique. Yes, they're uniquely popular. And I saw online that they're doing this special edition, like, unicorn kisses flavor. Oh, wow. um, and then it turns out it's like a April Fool's thing. It's not April Fool's yet. Don't play me like that. <laughs> but um, I think they are actually putting out a very limited number of Unicorn Kisses seltzer waters. So I need to know, like, where can I get my hands on that? I want it. I guess it tastes like Skittles, like a fruity type thing. I just want it. I want it. I'll never get it. Mm. Look at that! They have a horsey unicorn logo. I want it. You'll never get it. It's just gonna be like the stupid Ben and Jerry's. <laughs> Hi. Hi. Oh, flannel man! I see you have your wiener out. What? <laughs> I'm just kidding. I had to. Oh, God. All right. Your we It should have. I should have said your wieners. All right, so here's some um, vegan hot dogs, AKA brats, and some beautiful pressure cooked sauerkraut. But what's the real star of this dinner? This right here. No, I thought it was the mashed potatoes yeah, that you begged it. me for. That too, but I do like Oh the my God. You should be ashamed of yourself how much you begged. <laughs> Quiet. Lucy, please. Oh my goodness. So that's a very nice dinner you it made for yourself is. there. And I see you even got your take and bake. Yeah. Are you having some? I'm not. Why? Because I'm a fatty. No, you're not. You could totally be drinking 2%. Totally. You're really not. Um, excuse me, Barking Chain. Let's cut that link right here. <laughs> Lucy just went... Oh. Happy National Puppy Day! Yay. I can't neglect the pup whose name is Puppy! Mr. Puppy! Yay! Uh, Sean, uh, please turn that down. Thank you. <laughs> Minds are about to be lost. Yeah? Is it all that? And a wiener? <laughs> We're also having string beans. <laughs> How excited are you for this dinner? I'm not huge on um, sausage and stuff, but... Bangers and mash. Mm, is that what they call that? Yeah. I don't know. I thought bangers and mash was like is fried. Is the apple one though? No. Oh. It's the brat. It's the beer brat. We used up the apple one. You didn't even know it. Oh, man. I know, right? It was in the beans Who's or something one night. Well, she does eat meat. I think she <laughs> ate one today. No. I thought I saw her. Yeah. I saw her do it. <laughs> I effing saw her do it, man. <laughs> All right, well, we're going to eat because we're about to watch Survivor. <laughs> yeah, 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 Survivor. That's nothing. All right. <laughs> okay. 
I was going to do survivor. Or you could do I'm a survivor. I'm going to eat. All right, turn it off. Hello. Hello. <laughs> <laughs> What's up? Mmm. We're almost done working. Almost. Going to bed early. Yeah. Finally. Woo! Nuts. <laughs> Literally. <laughs> and nuts. Mm-hmm. Okay. So. Yeah. <laughs> I just want a couple cashews. Right. That's been a long day. Mm-hmm. As usual. <laughs> Maddie was so pissed today. Oh, I was. I really. I still am. She found out that. I uh, think I already talked about this, but. Oh, did you? Maybe not. I can't remember. I don't know, but the feeds are going to be. Maybe I was talking to Kristen about it. On, for the holiday weekend. She thought she would have a little break from the spoilers. Usually I do. But Arissa says, "Girl." <laughs> Those feeds are going to be on, I guarantee. Uh, so, yeah. There's that. <laughs> Puppy's really thirsty. You. He really is. He's a very loud drinker. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> he loves his water. Of course. Oh, Baby, Papa. I love you. He said I gave up soda years ago. <laughs> <laughs> Disclaimer, he was never drinking soda. I just drink straight up water. Good that's, boy. That's what I've always done. That's why I'm so healthy. <laughs> Alright. So, we're just going to call it. Time of death here is 10.56. 7. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed this. Okay. <laughs> if you're new, thank you for subscribing. We appreciate it because you're awesome. And until next time.